Mention it all. Mention it all. Goodbye, Kyle. Who's calling who a frog? Love you, baby. Bye. Hello Beret Troop, welcome back. I'm the real Andy of Beret Heels and welcome to another piece of tea. And now it is time to talk about the real housewife of Beret Heels. But before we get into it, do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Do it right now. If you are new here and you want to join the Beret Troop, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Hit the notification bell, guys. We are on our way to 30K. So if you want to join the family, you know what to do. And let's talk about this um, mess. Okay, so there are new reports, again, about this whole Aspen trip of Burberry Hills. I mean, girl, we have been talking about this trip so much that I am just, I'm really hoping that it's going to live to the expectations. Because we have been talking so much, I mean, they are putting so much information out there without even seeing the footage that I'm like, girl, this but this is this better be like the most dramatic trip this this must be more dramatic than the science trip of the real house of salt lake city right because i mean that's what i'm expecting i'm expecting screaming i'm expecting uh tears i'm expecting a drag i don't know because they are just putting so much information out there so for what we know it's all about you know kathy hilton having this major meltdown which it wasn't filmed, so now it's all about speculation, all about, you know, people saying this, people saying that, you know, people sending cis and desist, people doing all kind of crazy shit. But allegedly, you know, Kathy Hilton have this major uh, breakdown, like, so some people are saying that it was at a nightclub and that she had this major uh uh, meltdown because the DJ didn't want to put a song of Michael Jackson that she requested that it had to be like put just because she was there before she arrived. Okay, uh, and apparently, you know, they're saying that she uh, lose her shit on him. Um, that they were that she was screaming all these racist and homophobic slurs and blah blah blah. There are also rumors saying that she continued the whole meltdown at. Uh, Kyle Richard's house, you know, and like uh, that supposedly she screamed some stuff at Sutton's assistant and like homophobic slurs and the F word and like a bunch of things, you know, and uh, I mean, they are just putting Kathy Hilton, honestly, in the worst light possible. And it is intense, right? Well, now we're getting new reports that are saying that actually Erica Jane is one of the one having a major problem with Kathy Hilton and that they are in non-speaking terms at all, okay? I don't know how much to believe about this new rumor, but anyways, uh, basically it says here, according to um, Bravo Housewives, that Erica Jane and Kathy Hilton are not in speaking terms after Erica Jane revealed a stunning allegation against Kathy Hilton in the fallout of their trip to Aspen, Colorado. Erica alleges that Kathy made a harsh slur against an employee of camera, which I'm guessing it will be Sutton's um, assistant, which for what we know, it's a member of the LGBT community. Uh, then it says over here, Kathy never faced Erica after she made the accusations and ceased filming with the group afterwards. So, um, I, I, I remember reading somewhere that Lisa Rena like was very upset with Kathy Hilton over this and that Erica Jane as well was very, um, angry at this. Now, we know that Erica Jane, Dorit Kemsley, and Diana Jenkins are going to be leaving the trip literally in the middle of the night. Apparently, that's what we were told, right? Because of this fight. But we don't know exactly what is this whole fight about. Because initially, it was also told to us that Lisa Rena was accusing Erica Jane of self-medicating, you know, and like basically using words like she needed rehab and that she needed to um, 
and then that she needed an intervention and that that, you know, sparked the whole thing. But now we're also hearing that Kathy Hilton did this horrible thing and that Erica Jane and Lisa Rena are completely like blown away. The Kathy Hilton will go this way. Now, my thing and why it's so hard for me to like take this rumor as true as 100% truth is just because I know that the Fox 5 4, which is actually the Fox 4 4s, um, wanted to take. Kathy Hilton out of the show. You know, apparently they were not happy at all that Bravo gave Kathy Hilton a race and that they don't know how much it is actually that race. So they think it's not fair that she is getting a race for basically not doing shit while they are just like, you know, being there every single episode and some of them didn't get any race for this season, one of them being Lisa Rena. So, um, so that's why, I mean, because this is coming from a closed source. And, I'm, you know, every time it says a closed source, it's like, girl, please. We know it's some, some of them. But anyways, um, I don't know. Like, I'm very confused. You know, I, some people are saying that Kathy Hilton, it is capable of that. You know, it is capable of being racist and homophobic and all of those things. But at the same time, I will be, like, very surprised because, you know, they live in a war with Paris Hilton, you know, and all of them that are very, like, open to the community. So it kind of, like, think it will be weird. And because there is no footage, because there is no hot mic uh, moment, there is nothing, apparently, from that fight. It's just so up to interpretation and to, like, why, like, they can just do whatever they say, whatever they want. Kathy Hilton came forward uh, a while ago on an interview and she literally said that all of this was fake, that she didn't have any meltdown, that she wasn't screaming anything, that she wasn't throwing any shit at anyone, you know, and that all of this was fake. But at the same time, we have also like, why is Kyle Richards not saying anything, right? And apparently, again, the Fox 4, whatever force, which is Dorit, Kyle, Erica, and Lisa Rena. Well, and the boring one, but the boring one is not here anymore. Um, like, they want Kathy Hilton out. So, you know what I mean? Like, how are we supposed to believe this? Also, this will, like, a news like this, like, oh, my God, Erica Jane is defending a member of the LGBT community. Of course, it's going to give her some points after everything that she's going out. Uh, she's... Um, Shit, Latino moment, guys. After everything that she's uh, going through, you know? So, like, it will be like, oh, she's defending. Okay, let's let's forget that she owns millions of dollars to widows and orphans and uh, a bunch of people. You know what I mean? So, mm, I don't know. I don't know what to believe on this one. So, I need your help. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Do you believe that Kathy Hilton did this? Do you believe that the Fox 4... Uh, Force is trying to take Kathy Hilton down. What do you think is happening? Or do you think that actually Erica Jane is defending someone and have now this major beef with Kathy Hilton? Like, what is going on? Let me know. And like always, don't forget to like this video, share this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, guys, and I'll see you in an hour for another piece of tea. See ya. Bye.